I'm Ann Elizabeth Burns at EEB Studios. We're an online acting studio and I want to encourage you to stop making strong choices. I know your acting teacher has told you this. I know that maybe your agent, the casting directors, all they tell us all the time to make a strong choice, make a strong choice. What I think they're talking about, and this is something we started talking about in classes and the actors are going crazy for it because it, it's so much clearer. Instead of making a strong choice or not making a weak choice, what I want to encourage you is to make a clear and vivid choice. If you're supposed to you know, be really angry at your scene partner in a scene, the audience, whoever's watching your audition tape has no idea that you're angry, it's because the choice that you've made is not clear and it's not vivid. It's gray, it's mushy, it's not clear and vivid, right? So let's say you have to be angry. You could say, okay, I'm going to be chill. Oh, I'm so chill, I'm so chill, I'm so chill. And then you go into your scene, right? That was the emotional through line exercise that I just used. Okay, that doesn't work. Do you see what happens in my body when I just become chill? I'm so pissed, I'm so pissed, I'm so pissed, <gasps> right? <laughs> when you make a clear, in vivid choice and then you use the emotional through line exercise that's kind of a different thing I didn't mean to necessarily go into that today but if you say a line three times in a row that is a mo that um, has a strong you know emotional essence behind it it can help you to clarify the choice that you're making and it can be much more vivid this is something I work with in my monologue classes and in cold read classes a lot but this idea of clear and vivid clear and vivid clear and vivid so how do you know if it's clear and vivid? Well, I wanna encourage you, when you tape, go back, watch the tape, ask yourself, do I know beyond a shadow of a doubt how that character feels? And if you don't, you may have to reach for something deeper, something more clear and more vivid. Put in the comments if that's helpful for you or, or shoot us an email because like I said, I've been introducing this concept in classes. You can just see the actor's shoulders and the, ten the tension <laughs> just go away because it's like, oh my gosh, I get it now. I know how to make a strong choice. Don't make a strong choice, just make a clear and vivid choice. And it really seems to be working for our actors. I hope that's helpful for you. Let us know. See you in class.